Hey, what's up everybody? So today I've got a little bit of a product review for you guys of these right here. These are the stick twirls and I'm super excited to show them to you. Um, I really wanted to sit down after using them in a video and having featured them in some product videos before. Uh, I got a lot of questions and a lot of people like, whoa, what is that for? Why do you have it? You know, is it just for spinning the sticks? Do you need it? So I really wanted to sit down and kind of give you guys my opinion on the stick twirls. And so um, it certainly has changed from using them and actually spending a lot of time playing with them and trying them out and really seeing whether or not it's just a a twirl your stick kind of like gimmick or something or if there's actual a lot of value and opportunity to these stick twirls and I've really found that there is so I want to tell you about it let's get started all right so a little backstory behind the stick twirls how did I end up using them and finding them I was at NAMM 2017 this year and I was walking around looking for products to check out and I saw these people at this booth spinning sticks around like crazy. I mean, it's kind of hard to ignore, like what in the world's going on there? How is that happening? And uh, me being a showman of sorts, someone who really enjoys the visual aspect to playing, it caught my eye. So I walk over and check it out. And to be honest, um, first thought was, wow, it's kind of cool for like showmanship, but it seems a little gimmicky. Like why on earth would you want this past like spinning your stick like you can already spin your stick and do all sorts of things and like I don't need these to have showmanship like what what are they for is there anything past that and so um, I've come to discover there's actually a lot past that and it's the reason I really wanted to show it to you guys it's the reason that um, after speaking with the creator I really believe in the stick twirl as something that's really valuable to a lot of players out there now I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that every single person who's ever played drums and ever will play drums needs to have the stick twirl now I think it's a lot of fun and I think if you have the cash to pick it up and play with it and have fun with it I think it's definitely worth it but you don't have to have it and even the creator of stick twirl Don he's not going to tell you like you cannot play drums without this you know it's it's not like that it's something that is meant to add to your playing and to help your playing and um, today I wanted to tell you why it is that I feel that's important and why I feel that they're very powerful But I'm not even the only person who is really impressed with these I found out that Dennis Chambers has been using these and loves them and he's actually becoming like an endorser ambassador of the product So that's pretty cool. Like if you don't if you don't take my word for how valuable they are like Dennis Chambers is the man so you can go check out what he has to say on the stick twirl soon, but um, what I find intriguing and interesting and awesome about these is that yeah you can spin them around and, and do the stick twirl kind of thing but they're not just for that they're to help with the way that you hold the sticks they're to help with your ability to hold the sticks and they're really to help with your technique in a way that um, sometimes due to fatigue sometimes due to injury there is trouble holding onto the stick. I know some of you out there have had injuries to your hands, to your wrists, to your fingers, to your muscles, um, maybe had a stroke or something where you have a hard time holding onto the stick. And this right here really, really is life changing because all of a sudden, like, you don't even have to have your fingers around the stick for you to be able to hold onto it and keep it there. So if you can't hold on with every finger, if you don't have the strength to hold on, this is like a little cheat even though it's not cheating you know you do whatever you want but um, it's a little way of helping out with that hand issue of holding on to the sticks like one of the things that I heard from uh, some reviews of this product is that there are some people who literally could not hold on to the sticks they got the stick twirl and they're playing drums again like if that was the end of it like that's the reason I want to show it to you because if there's one of you out there who can't hold on to the stick properly, but you wanna play drums, then I hope this helps you. So um, that right there was enough for me to say, oh yeah, I really wanna show people this. But also I've discovered from my own playing that sometimes after hours and hours and hours, I have hand fatigue and arm fatigue and my hands start getting sweaty. I've played shows where a stick has flown out of my hand. I'm sure a lot of you know all about that. Uh, when you're playing really hard and your hands get sweaty and it's super hot, this right here is a little way of making sure that doesn't happen because like the stick is not coming out of your hand when you've got these on it even if you let go you know so um, that is something that I really find valuable about these right here I've been doing a lot of manual labor at my house I'm doing some construction and doing some landscaping and yesterday I sat at a piano for like four hours and my hands are really really tired today and I felt it when I started to play I was playing something pretty heavy 
lots of craziness, lots of volume, and my sticks started to slip out of my hands. I was having trouble holding them. And so I put these back on, I was playing around with it again, and I was like, man, these really are helpful when it comes to fatigue and when it comes to being able to hold onto the sticks when you're tired or when your hands are sweaty. And so those two things alone are very, very valuable to me. And I really feel like they are something that may be a reason for you to look into trying these out. Now, the way these work is you actually just slide them onto the sticks. And the cool thing about them is that it's really hard to slide them onto the sticks. And that may seem really dumb, but that's a good thing because it keeps them from sliding around when you're playing. You don't want to be playing and all of a sudden your fingers slide up here. You know, that's not gonna be good. That's, that doesn't help at all. And so they do a good job of staying in place. If you do have an issue where you're playing really, really hard and they do move a little bit, I've put a little tape in front of and behind um, the stick twirl just to make sure that it stays exactly in place because I have had it slide a little bit on me when I was playing. And then other than that, I mean, you can adjust it to where you want. Like this is just a normal Vic Firth Titan um, with the stick twirl. I've been keeping it like in between the F and I, but it kind of just depends on your stick and the length and where it is that you hold the stick and your fulcrum and everything where you'd like to have it. And so um, it does take some getting used to. When I first put them on, I was like, uh, I don't know, this is, this is a little weird, but the more that I played with them, the more that I experienced the benefits that they do offer when you use them correctly. And of course, you know, that part right there, that took a little getting used to too. Um, there's probably a blooper reel somewhere of me trying to like spin them for the first few times and it not going so well But you also can see some footage at NAMM where I pick them up and it, it is kind of a natural thing Like it's the first time I'm ever messing around with them and it it makes sense and it, it feels right You just have a little bit of a learning curve. So uh, I'll show you a little bit of playing footage with them I'll show you some of that cover that I just did and some of the twirls and everything and uh that's about it for stick twirl. I wanted to I wanted to show it to you guys. I wanted you to know about it in case you had no idea there's something out there that can help you hold on to the stick or can add to your showmanship. And uh, I hope it helps you. Let me know down below if you got any questions and uh, you can check it out. Link is in the top of the description. Thanks so much for watching. See you later.